one of the things I found as an undergraduate was that people were giving me criticisms like not enough critical thinking or not enough independent research. And I didn't really know what those things meant. So the idea of, uh, of my pedagogical features is, is to kind of um, lead the students into uh, thinking um, at a higher level and to researching um, in, 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 in the way an academic would. And I think that's a kind of gradual process. You're not, in, by the end of the first, you're gonna have really the, the kind of free-flowing critical thinking that we, we value um, so much in, in, in psychology. But you are going to have a, almost an internalized dialogue from answering my questions that I think is a, a stepping stone towards that, that kind of critical thinking. So critical thinking and high level thinking in general is a big part of it. But I also wanted to get some challenging in there um, to be a little bit more independent, to wean oneself off one's A-level textbook or, and even any, any textbook as soon as possible in the process. But also to understand why. So there's a, an element of reflection in the book uh, as, as well as the thinking, as well as the actual research exercise. I want students to understand why these things are important and how to go about them, not and just escape the vague anxiety that these things are important, but we don't know how to do them.